And that's why he was as open as he was in the flat. Tempo now for the Steelers as they get up to the line of scrimmage and Warren is brought down by Zadarius Smith. Two seconds average time for put to pressure. They get there. Jackson goes down. Miles Garrett on the chop. And the speed to get there. Look how quick he is. And Patrick McCarry has no chance to keep him out of the backfield. Third down. Lost the football and he's loose. As you said, that ball getting yeah. slippery. Purdy got it back, but now they're definitely at a field goal range. I mean, he, that thing clearly comes out. He's lucky he was able to recover and at least give their team a chance to punt. But these last two, these last two attempts to pass, if it continues to rain, this is something to keep an eye on. With those precious seconds coming off the clock, second and ten. Minshew steps up. Football's loose. Cleveland has it. And the Browns turn out the lights on Indianapolis. It was on its last gasp. Just about ready to put the final touches on a thrilling comeback victory. I don't think it's going to just work magically from the very first snap. There is going to be a feeling out process. Toon sacked again, Zadarius Smith. This is just, just ridiculous. And Zadarius Smith, not big numbers this year as far as sacks, but his pressure rate, the way he affects the passer has been for the Browns in the division. Toon hands to Ingram, and they lose yardage again. Zadarius Smith. Ravens must get to the 21 for a first down. Jackson taken down. Back at the 37-yard line. The former Ravens, Darius Smith along. This is an interesting one. The pocket really collapses, but there's no one necessarily that gets a ton of pressure on Jackson. He actually run into his own guy, and then when he tries to step up, everybody sheds off their linemen, and then they get the sack. Give it to him. The play was in slow motion. Zadarius Smith. He wants to eat. Loss of three. Zadarius Smith almost appeared not blocked. I mean, he just fights his way through the attempted block by Darnell Washington, the rookie out of Georgia, who was a, an excellent blocker. But he's trying to step down to get to Smith. And Smith is too quick and gets down and upfield and eat big fella. Jaleel McLaughlin, the running back, gets the carry. Bounced right into the belly of Shelby Harris, and then Zadarius Smith finished him off. ETN shifts to the backfield. Lawrence making his 47th straight start, trying to run. And Lawrence is short of the first down. He probably didn't want to early. Because the pass play that he wanted to Travis Etienne on the outside was taken away. They give you that little bit of extra and allow you to play through the ball. Lawrence got tagged by Tomlinson. That ball nearly picked off on the outside by Newsom. Darius Smith talked all week about increasing his sack totals and more pressure on the quarterback. And he makes a play there, tipping the ball. And Newsom, number zero, almost comes up with one. Third and seven. Keenum out of the pocket. Trying to buy time. Keenum is not going to get out of there. Zadarius Smith will get his sack. Nowhere to go with it. And now he's trying to move. And there's Tomlinson. There's Zadarius Smith. The sack he didn't get before. Something to get this offense going. And that's not going to help. Zadarius Smith has got another sack. He takes down Case Keenum. Big loss, 10 yards on the play. I think they're just ignoring the play action. They're just going right to the quarterback. It's a not, a not a normal deal. When they were trying to get Dalton Schultz, the tight end, to come back and pin down Zadarius Smith, but Smith beat him upfield and got to the quarterback. Third and eight. Keenum hit as he throws. It's up there, and it's intercepted. Deron Harmon, the veteran, with the pick. 
Zadarius Smith put the heat on Keenum. And that was Keenum trying to throw it, and Zadarius Smith, who's having a day.